just say this in the full knowledge that my parents are watching this. Nobody wants to turn into their parents when they grow up. So, let me prepare to be weirded out. I want to be like my mom when I grow up. Yeah, it sounds pretty bad when I say it out loud too. Qualifications time! When young kids talk about things, you know, especially their parents, what they and what they want to be, they might say things like, I want to be an astronaut, I want to be a mailman, or I want to be like my mom or my dad. But that's not really what they're saying. See, what kids mean, like any people, is that they're looking for power, or not power, power, uh, but agency in their own uh, lives. Uh, we all want to have a say in our lives, even when we're really small. That's why teenagers are kind of a pain, because they think they know what agency looks like and are usually fucking it up. That's okay, that's pretty normal. It's why parents and teens often fight, because of that divide with neither side necessarily seeing what the other is talking about or trying to accomplish. So, I mean, yes, there could be respect issues or a ton of other things going on, but even when everything is great, uh, that can be a particularly rough point for families who have a child hitting that portion of development. When kids are quite young and parents reminisce about how great the kids were, that's actually because that's the, the world was entirely defined by the parents at that time. Uh, you know, like a tyrant do. But then kids get going back to school or they wander around the neighborhood and they start getting ideas from other sources. Um, good or bad, they find a fertile ground in, their, in the child's developing worldview. And now uh, the role models begin to take place uh, on the main stage past the parents, sometimes still including them, but not always. Then the worst happens. They become adolescents. And friends take main stage. Uh, defining those values becomes all about finding the cult of personality that the adolescent wants to belong to. Uh, Whatever is most important to them, jock, pop, goth, anything will work. And I lied because then the worst worst happens. The adolescent transforms into a dun 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 teenager. They begin testing their own value systems, working or not, and they're doing it on their own, which finally helps them have something that looks somewhat developed right about the time they turn into a young adult, right around 20 to 25, um, having your own opinions and such, hopefully informed and educated. Now, back to what's important. When I take time to look back at all the people that I respect and love, it's really hard to beat my mom. She's strong, supportive, still independent, and preemptively kind to people she doesn't really know, and yet still able to lay down good boundaries. So, yeah, I want to be like my mom.